This video outlines how to set up an Apache server for your home network. You should already be familiar with moving files to and from your Raspberry Pi using an FTP client such as FileZilla. At the terminal screen, we first must use apt-get to download and install Apache. Once the installation is complete, navigate to the directory var slash www. If we list the files present in this directory, we see that there is a file called index.html. This is the default web page for the server. Before we can edit this file, we must change the ownership of the directory var www to the user pi. We do this using the change owner command. To edit index.html, we can use the nano text editor. Let's try a simple edit. It works great. Now after saving this file, we can access this web page via a web browser from any computer connected to the same network as the Raspberry Pi. To do this, we open a web browser and type the IP address of the Raspberry Pi, which should lead us to the index.html page. And there we have it, the edited file displaying it works great. So our server is running, all we need to do now is add some content. To move files to the server, we can use an FTP client. In this case, I'm using FileZilla. On the right side, we need to locate where the files are stored for the server, which is var, and at the bottom of that, www. Again, we see index.html, which we could edit or replace. But for now, let's try moving some files over from another computer. This folder contains some files that I want to make available to the network. It looks like everything copied over without any problems. Now if we type the IP address of the web server, followed by the name of the folder that we moved to the server, we see that the files can be accessed through a web browser. So following these steps, you can make any file accessible to any computer connected to your home network.